The best uncommitted player in the 2015 class has committed. Indiana's Mr. Basketball, Caleb Swanigan, number nine on the ESPN 100, is heading to Purdue. I'm Kerry Chow, joined by ESPN National Recruiting Director Paul Biancardi. Paul Swanigan is a 6'9 center out of Homestead, Indiana, decommitted out of Michigan State, finally picked Purdue over Kentucky. This move surprise you? A little bit, yeah. He took some visits, uh, Kentucky, Duke, Arizona. He took unofficial visits to Michigan State and Purdue. He eventually committed to Michigan State uh, to decommit and then end up back at Purdue, who is in his backyard. So this one is a head-scratcher. But nevertheless, uh, Purdue ends up the winner in this sweepstakes. Yeah, what's this mean for Purdue next season? Well, now they have more size, girth, and skill uh, to wear out opponents inside, uh, posting up and on the glass. And defensively, they can be really hard to score against with the length and the girth uh, that they have with Hammonds, Haas, and now Swanigan. Uh, the Big Ten is going to be loaded, loaded with front court talent next year, especially a lot of new talent. Michigan State has Deontay Davis. Indiana has Thomas Bryant. You look at Maryland, they have Diamond Stone, all ESPN top 100 big men. It's going to be a league of big men next year for sure. Whose skill set does Swanigan remind you of? He reminds me a little bit of Zach Randolph, uh, the, the former Michigan State player now for the Grizzlies. Uh, doesn't have a lot of lift, but his ability to rebound, carve out space inside and score um, just really reminds me of him, uh, Randolph left-handed, uh, Caleb Swanigan right-handed. Swanigan can step out to about the mid-range and knock it down at the same time. But when you're talking inside the paint and at the rim to get your shot off, to create space, to have excellent footwork, to make a post move, Swanigan reminds me of Randolph. Paul, thank you very much. All right, thank you. For the latest on the recruiting trail, check out Recruiting Nation on ESPN.com.